Most new parents tend to baby-proof everything, but what about the bathtub? Safety regulators found some problems and pushed for tougher safety requirements. But as KXAN's Arzo Dose discovered, it's not clear if baby bathtubs being sold here in Central Texas meet the new safety standards. Okay, here we go. Oh, look. Little Max loves bath time. It can quickly calm him down. And he kind of likes, like, kicking around in the water, and he likes the feel of the washcloth. So, yeah, he likes it. He inherited the tub from his big brother. I just expect it to be safe and be working if it's, you know, available for purchase. The U.S. Consumer Product Safety Commission wants it to be that way. Safety regulators say parents should buy infant bathtubs that were manufactured on or after October 2nd. These bathtubs must meet new safety requirements, which include better warnings printed on the tubs with information about drowning and falling and more durable tubs so parts don't break easily. So how do you know if your baby's bathtub meets these new safety requirements? Well, the Consumer Product Safety Commission says look at the box or even the tub itself for a manufacture date. Well, we did that, and the problem is that it's really not easy to find. In fact, even several store managers couldn't point it out. They also didn't really even know about these new safety standards. I'm always just really aware and cautious around bath time. Max's mom says it may be time to upgrade. It just gives you peace of mind if you have something that you know for a fact is safe. And even with a new bathtub, she knows being right there is the safest. Arzo Dost, KXAN News. Arzo checked with a number of stores, including Bye Bye Baby, Target, and Walmart, and was told they rely on suppliers to make sure their products meet federal standards. We have reached out to several suppliers and are waiting to hear back if bathtubs on the shelves right now for sale meet the new safety requirements. Well, that's not the only product facing some tougher standards. The Consumer Product Safety Commission approved new ones for infant bouncer seats. Now all seats must address tip-over incidents and fix the battery compartment to prevent corrosion and overheating. The tougher regulations aim to prevent head injuries and even death.